Thank you for joining us for the Tradex Foods 3-Minute Market Insight, the Monday Morning Pulse Report for seafood purchasers. Some fast facts to start this week's insight. It has been reported that a major Canadian importer has lost their QMPI license. The Canadian Food Inspection Agency caught the company importing 95% net weight products from Dalian Long Thai out of China. All containers exported by Dalian Long Thai will be returned to China. In the news this week, rumors of labor issues in China are ringing true. Every year following the Chinese New Year, workers return to the processing plants. However, in recent years, the number who has come back has dwindled and plants have been forced to send recruiters to inland cities. This year is no exception. Plants are reporting difficulties finding enough employees. All customers should be advised that these labor issues may result in delayed shipments. On another topic, a few weeks ago we reported that skyrocketing halibut prices were translating into increased prices for Alaskan Pollock. However, this scenario appears to be changing. Raw material Alaskan Pollock prices have dropped by $100 to $200 per metric ton in the last week. The reason for the decline stems from high quotas in both Alaskan and Russian fisheries. Russian fishermen anticipated that the added supply would bring prices down, down and over the last month have been dumping product into China. As a result, prices for the Russian H&G Pollock came down by almost $900 per metric ton in the last month. And so, declining Alaskan Pollock prices are a spillover effect brought on by increased supply of Russian product. Alaskan Pollock prices most recently quoted at about $1,800 per metric ton will likely decline a bit more before hitting rock bottom. In other news, Tradex recently launched Sinbad Platinum Premium Alaskan Cod. This market continues to hold tight. Soaring halibut prices are forcing people to substitute halibut for, for cod and consequently demand for Alaskan cod is increasing. Prices will likely remain high until Atlantic, season, Atlantic cod season opens in the spring, at which point in time they may level out. Thank you for joining me for the Tradex Foods 3-Minute Market Insight. This is Robert Ryerson. Buy smart and eat more seafood.